Hi everyone, Jeff Teague in Raleigh, North Carolina. I'm gonna show you what I think is so special about 4Runner TRD Sport 2022. We got two of them. Now these are 2022s, but for 2023, stay tuned till the end of the video. One of these colors is going away for 23 and a new color is appearing. Ah, ah, ah. Today we've got with us a 2022 TRD Sport in Lunar Rock. This is two wheel drive. The Army Green one is also two wheel drive. You can get them in two or four wheel drive. As far as pricing, factory MSRP on a two wheel drive is about 40,950, I think. And then it's about 42,800 for the four wheel drive. So just a little bit less than $2,000 more. The question is, which one do you like better and do you like TRD Sport? Oh yeah, another question. Just what is TRD Sport? TRD Sport gives 4Runner fans another option for purchase. This one here, think of it, boy, I hate to even say that, the poor man's limited. What do I mean by that? Well, it's got similar suspension. It's got the same suspension as a limited. It's got the X Reyes, X dash R E A S, another acronym. Well, anyway, it is smooth on road performance, allows for wheel articulation. It allows for bumps, movement, ruts, potholes, things like that. Just grooves. The groove is in the heart. Let's groove tonight. No. It's also gonna have these signature 20 inch wheels here. It's two tones, so a darker gray, along with the silver metallic accents. It looks very, very similar to Limited, except for Limited, it's gonna be blinged out in chrome. This one here, a little bit more subtle, a little bit more subdued. Dude, what's our takeaway message in the front? Well, it's gonna have the color keyed, thick horizontal slats. It's got LED fog lights, daytime running lights, low beams, high beams, it's got it all. You'll see this camera right here, that's for the panoramic view monitor. It allows you to see all the way around the vehicle. It's got Toyota safety sense on it here, nice chrome bling going on. Two wheel is gonna have a nine inch ground clearance. If it's four wheel, that'll have 9.6 inch ground clearance. Has a 4.0 liter V6 engine, and it's gonna give you 270 horsepower 278 pound-feet of torque. You might recognize it from the hood scoop. I said the hood scoop, the scoop, the scoop, the scoop is on fire. These are hot. Do you like TRD Sport? I want some comments in the comment section. Whoop, whoop. At the end of the video, we're gonna be showing the window sticker so you can see specs, how it's blinged out. You can also see what it's like if you have that sliding rear cargo deck in back, because one of them does one of them doesn't. Let's look at the profile here. What do we have? Well, Jim, well, Tony, well, Ken, we've got TRD Sport here in silver metallic, fuel tank on the driver's side. We've got a little black going on here. Not gloss, but black. Then we've got auto lock, auto unlock here. Whoop. That means push button start, yo. It's got turn signal indicators in the house. Chapoom. Then we've got blind spot monitor right there. Pretty awesome. What do you think? In the back part of 4Runner, I always think it's cavernous. It's huge, it's really large. You'll get good leg room, really good leg room, I think. Really good head room. So that's kind of cool. Look around. Then we've got USB ports down here. We've got rear air. I like that. So both of these in the interior are gonna be the same, whether you get the Lunar or the Army. I might switch it up just so we can mix it up. Got that eight inch multimedia screen there. How does this look interior cabin wise? Let's tool around on the inside here, TRD headrest. It's gonna be black soft tech seating with the light gray stitching. And you'll see it pretty much consistent all the way throughout the door panels the dash. Hey, look, TRD shift knob. Hi, TRD, what's up? TRD John, I don't know. Look at this back window here. People love it. Dogs love it. Your pet ferret, your pet chinchilla. Everyone loves it. It's big. Four out of five chinchillas actually choose Forerunner back windows. I don't think you knew that stat, did you? Did you? All right, we've got a 12 volt circular in here. Then we've got, this is where the four wheel drive contraption would go right here. 
nice chunky knobs. You can actually turn those when you got on work gloves and things like that. It's got Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Sirius XM. We've got USB, 12 volt circular in the house. All right, and then just some things that you can do. It's pretty easy. I don't want to turn the audio on, but we could do Sirius XM here. I said I didn't want to turn that on. All right, then we got our temperature up here. The air actually blows out really cool. I just don't have it on now because it'll mess with my audio. But we've got sunglass holder, home link for garage door openers. What it will not have is the off-roading tools like crawl control, multi-terrain select. Those things are not going to be here. We've got lighted mirrors with a long slider, so it's going to cover that window for you. And then right here, we've got the 4.2 inch information display. Shows you basic information, just basic. You're so basic. Shows you basic information that you might want about your vehicle. Just like that. Steering angle, tire pressure, radar cruise control, lane departure alert. That tells you if maintenance is due soon or maybe low tire pressure. Things that you might need. We'll look at those too. Vehicle settings, tire pressure warning system, rear seat reminder. That reminds you that there might be something you left in the back. I bless the rains down in Africa. I bless the rains. It is going to take a lot to take me away from you. Anyway, we've got a view, panoramic view monitor. You can see in front of, along the sides of. And then if you put it in reverse, 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 reverse crisscross so you can see behind you one full view and then we've got different forms of grid line that you might want it's up to you so as we look inside we do not have a power passenger seat that would be nice obviously lumbar support you can go up down twist like we did last summer you can do the back of the seat whatever you want my friends nice place to put some chunky sport bottles there Soft touch here, all one touch windows. Nice touch, get it? Nice touch, <laughs> TRD Sport. And then we've got the panoramic view monitor, got automatic high beams. We've got all sorts of goodies, including on the steering wheel. So we'll just back out, boom. Take a look at 4Runner here. We've got two different configurations that we could use. Some people with 4Runners, they'll get third row seats, some will get Sliding rear cargo deck, some will get nothing. They'll all get 5,000 pound tow capacity. Whoop, whoop, holla. Then we've got backup camera there. What do you think this one's gonna have? Oh, it's empty, nothing. No soup for you. All right, so here we've got grounded power outlet, 12 volt circular, a place to put whatever you want, like a front license plate bracket. Uh-huh, but look here, we've got tie downs, and it's just empty. So let's take a field trip. We're gonna take a field trip over to Army Green. I'll bet Lunar Rock is jealous because this one has the sliding cargo deck. There it is. How much does it hold? If you guessed 440 pounds, you win. And what it does is you can pull it out right like that so you can sit on it for tailgating i'm going to the lover boy ario speedwagon and sticks concert tonight i can't wait i could use this because i could sit right here on that sliding cargo deck tailgate or i could watch my kids game whatever i want to do this is 350 dollar option we'll see that on the window sticker would you use it all right for 2023 Army Green is being discontinued across the 4Runner lineup, so you will not get that. I believe that Lunar Rock is still available, but you'll be getting on TRD Sport, TRD Off-Road. You can have the Lime Rush. Lime Rush, my friends. The TRD Pro Color for 2022 is sliding into TRD DMs for 2023. So now which one would you choose? Let's take a look at the window sticker so we can learn more. This is the two-wheel drive. We'll just look at this one because we can see everything we need to see about the other one too. Army green with graphite, always been made in Japan. Here are the safety ratings in the biggest number possible. 17 combined, 16 city, 19 highway. Whoop, whoop. Here's standard equipment. The engine performance with a five-speed automatic transmission. See that X-R-E-A-S, X-Reyes Sport Enhanced Suspension. 
All right, Toyota Safety Sense. It's got the power sliding rear window in the back. We like that. Skid plate. We've got eight inch touch screen. And then this is TRD Sport stuff. The hood scoop, the roof rails, whoop, whoop. We've got the color keyed front grill bar. We've got headrest, shift knob. What? It's all there. Okay, so here we go. 40,950, like I said, I was right on that one. Yay, me. Um, sliding rear cargo deck is 350. Technology package. That's gonna give you the monitor. It's gonna give you the blind spot monitor that we see there. And then we get it delivered. And then each vehicle is gonna have some options, no options, tons of options, all that stuff. So look these over with the pricing. There'll be some things you like, some things you don't like. It's the way it is. Some things will never change. That's just the way it is. And this one is 45,153. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know which color you would want. Lunar Rock, Army Green, maybe Lime Rush, the incoming new kid on the block. Maybe that's one you choose. Would you choose TRD Sport? Would you go Limited or another 4Runner trim level? Thanks so much. I'm on Instagram and TikTok at Toyota Jeff Reviews. And of course, hit subscribe. Thanks. Peace.